In the shadowy corners of history and the depths of mythology, there exist objects that defy explanation, containing an evil presence that can cast a dark cloud over those who possess them. These are not your ordinary toys, they are the stuff of legends, haunting remains of the past. Join us as we explore the world of the top five cursed objects, where every object conveys a horrific tale of death, misery, and the never-ending obsession with the strange. But before that, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for regular updates. Let's get started. Number 5. Robert the Doll Robert the Doll is a creepy doll who resides in a Key West museum. This tiny doll wears a sailor costume and has beady eyes that track your every move. It also has a wicked smile on its face. This seemingly innocent gift, which was made in the late 19th century for little Robert Eugene Otto, set off a reign of terror that lasted for a century. Robert reportedly exhibits mood swings, blinks its eyelids, and smiles loudly at night, according to visitors. The scariest stories, though, are about curses and bad things happening to anyone who makes fun of this doll. Robert the doll is still a problem that questions logic and belief. The persistent stories of Robert serve as a chilling warning about how fragile the boundaries between the natural and supernatural worlds really are. Number 4. Thomas Busby's Chair Thomas Busby's Chair, a dark antique of British criminal history, has long held a chilling image. Busby was an infamous English highwayman and killer who tortured the Yorkshire region in the late 18th century. In 1702, after being captured, he was given a death by hanging decision, ending his reign of terror. According to legend, Busby made an odd request before being put to death. He asked to have his last meal at his favorite pub, the Busby Stew Pin, and purportedly cursed the chair where he sat before departing for the gallows, declaring that anyone who dared to sit in it would meet a horrifying fate. Over the years, numerous tales of misfortune and tragedy have been linked to the cursed chair, leading to its eventual suspension from the ceiling to prevent anyone from using it. It stands there still as an unsettling reminder of Busby's evil legacy and a monument to the pervasive influence of superstition on the human brain. Number 3. The Crying Boy Paintings The Crying Boy Paintings refer to a series of mass-produced artworks that gained fame in the 1980s due to a strange and creepy urban legend. Typically, a little child is shown in these paintings with tears running down his face. Rumors spread that the crying boy paintings were often found unharmed in the ruins of burned houses, even when everything else had been destroyed by fire. People began to believe that the paintings brought misfortune or even started flames as a result of this. In fact, there is no reliable evidence to back up these claims. Frequently, the usage of fire-resistant materials in their frames can be linked to the fires where they were discovered undamaged. The myth surrounding the crying boy painting serves as a reminder of the influence of superstition and the resilience of urban legends in the face of plausible debunkings. Number 2. The Cursed Mirror In Louisiana, the Myrtles Plantation is well known for being an extremely haunted location, but a mirror inside the house adds to the creepy atmosphere. Nearby residents claim that this mirror is cursed. They contend that the mirror contains the ghosts of Sarah Woodruff and her two children who were poisoned long ago by their slave Chloe. The Myrtles Plantation has a long history, and it's said that this mirror holds a dark secret from the past. The story of the cursed mirror has developed over time as more and more people claim that they have seen odd and incomprehensible things when they look into it. Anyone who looked into it would witness their own reflection warp into a horrible, terrifying version of themselves, showing their innermost fears and desires. It seems as though the mirror is still holding on to the hurt and regret of the past, reluctant to let go of the tragic things that took place at the Myrtles Plantation. Number 1. The Dybuck Box The Dybuck Box, commonly referred to as the Haunted Jewish Wine Cabinet, is an evil antique enveloped in fear. Beginning from Jewish folklore, a Dybuck is believed to be an evil spirit that can possess and torture the living. When it was listed on eBay in the early 2000s, this specific box became well known. According to the owner, individuals who owned the box experienced odd and terrible incidents. It was rumored to have a Holocaust survivor's diebuck ghost tied inside the box for confinement. The box's dark past served as the basis for several publications and the horror film The Possession. 
While critics regard the debuck box as a clever scam or superstition, others who are interested in the paranormal continue to find it fascinating. There are boundaries that should not be crossed, just like the shadows that occasionally hide life's mysteries. I hope you liked the video. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for more updates. Thanks for watching.